High Scar Girl is one of the best slice of life anime I've ever seen. And it's it's based on a manga by Rensuke, uh, <laughs> if I say this right, Rensuke Oshikira. Uh, Ren it's based on a manga by, it's based on a manga by Rensuke Oshikiri. And uh, it's published by Square Enix. And it's really like, it's, it's demographic is sign-in, but I, I think it's better than sign-in. It's like slice of life style, like shonen. It's not even shonen, it's, it's comedy and it's got, and even girls can read it as well. It's so amazing. So High Scar Girl is about this uh, school kid who's into fighting games or into the arcades. He's into gaming. He loves gaming so much and he's really good at f fighting games like Street Fighter and all that. So it's like based in the 90s, which I can see why an adult audience loves it, but it's more than more than that. Um, it's, it's a lot more than that. So the first uh, episodes are based in the 90s where they are school kids and uh, Harold is very much um, into video games and he's good and then one day he loses a game and he fights against this player and this player is so good with like with her sangeef and it's so so amazing like playing as she's playing it and this uh, character is called Akira Ono this girl and we, he, I think she's like based on the Street Fighter producer's name, so it's very similar. But yeah, so Ono is very much uh, a mute. She can't talk whatsoever. I, I never heard her talk. I, I, and I like it that way. I like the fact that we don't hear her talk because it's kind of cute that we see it in a very physical. It's physical humor. It's a bit slapstick, and I like that kind of thing. So I don't like to hear her talk, or I don't want to. I like, it's such an endearing character trait. She talks by playing games, that's it. And she like loves games and she's awesome. And the, these two uh, kids have a rivalry and it becomes a blossoming friendship. And as uh, Slice of Life goes on, there's a bit of romance, like, you know, it's, it's very beautiful. And nine years later, they go into high school and it gets a bit more dramatic as well. And it's still, and they, you know, they go competitive, they go. So it's like Shonen Slice of Life. And it's like, what makes it one of the best anime I've seen is that it teaches you how to get good at fighting games and other fighting games and, and just video games in general. And it's, it's remarkable that it actually tells you all these awesome tips and tricks and hints and it teaches you how to get good at video games and it's awesome so you have like akira ono and haru and it's uh there's a rivalry between them it's, it's great it's awesome and it's kind of like slow it's got a, it's got a bit of everything there's like romance to it as well and later on um you have one character who is called Ko Koharu and Koharu is very much she's she's a friend of Haru and he she has a crush on him and they go into high school and stuff and there's a bit of a love triangle there and she ends up getting into video games because her dad owns a shop and has an arcade machine and she ends up uh, trying to compete and be rifles to Ono so Ono is a great character like she's just badass and it's just awesome it's i don't know when i watch it it feels good it's like slice of life it's it just makes me nostalgic and i think that's why people like it it's just one of those things like it, you just feel happy and it's like it's a i don't know i relate to it a lot uh like that nostalgia and childhood it's a feel good kind of thing even though it does have some pretty emotional moments as well but not too dark it's not a dark show there's nothing dark about it it's just really uh, although there is like probably a little bit of stuff but it, it's got some good drama to it and good rivalries and a little bit of sprinkled romance and oh it's just some um, really good characters the characters are 
end up talking to the the video game characters talk to the main characters like like imagination or just like 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 don't give up you can do it like pick me i'll make you win the fight like it's just like really stupid funny stuff like that and it just makes it so funny like Kairu picks Akuma or Goki like oh no she knows the ultimate cheat code to get this character and it's just so funny uh it's it's stuff like that which as a gamer I really love it I think it's great and it's I, I just relate to it so much I think anyone can get into it and just enjoy it's like anyone can watch it like you know your daughter your sisters your your children just like and it's so it's so wholesome and such a good show like it's it has kind of a little bit of adult jokes but not it'll be over your head kind of. and it's just one of those like it goes over your head but it's still it's not too over the top you know you can still it's got some slapstick humor to it it's got cute style maui maui style to it but it's still it's it's so endearing and I think it's like 3D animation, like a 3D style. It's not like uh, hand drawn. It's something very. I it, I think while watching it, uh, it's got 3D animation, and I like that. I, I just like it. I like Ono as a mute because it's just her, and it's like it doesn't matter. She she expresses herself through fighting games, and I love that she expresses herself through video games. And she's just adorable, and she doesn't even have to talk. She's so badass and cool. She's just awesome, and yeah, uh, I I can't. It's one of the best animes I have seen, and you gotta you gotta watch it. It's just if you haven't seen it yet, you seriously gotta watch it. And um, it's um. It's wholesome, it's endearing, it just makes me feel happy watching it. And I want it to have more seasons. I want more seasons, I want more characters and more rivals and stuff. And I want it to go through college and go through the PlayStation era and like PlayStation 2 eras and stuff like that. And just like learning about the game industries and learning about the tournaments and competitive gaming it's just i want stuff like that it's i don't know it's just great I, I freaking love it it's it's a good show it's a good show because it speaks to me and it just it just makes me remember those times it, it's something i truly relate to and i think we can all relate to it as gamers as well and yeah if you're into anime and gaming it's just it's just awesome and that's a lot of love there's a lot of love for it, so I highly recommend you watch it if you're into gaming and get other people involved in the show. It's uh, it's a brilliant show. Uh, anyway, I think I've said enough. Uh, it's like, yeah, I've said I said all what I've said. Like, I rather you watch it and be surprised when you see it. So, anyway, I'll end the video here. So, thank you for watching.